All right, today is the last day of chemo. I didn't think this day would ever come and it is finally here. So we're getting ready to head out the door, um, go get our stuff, go to chemo. It's the last one, the last chemo. So excited for this because I am tired of feeling like crap all the time and maybe now I can start getting some energy back, start getting back to some of my regular activities like lifting heavier, um, even though that's going to be short lived because I have an appointment on the 19th to talk to my surgeon to figure out our surgery day for our double mastectomy. I don't know when it's going to be yet, but it's going to be sometime in April. And yeah, so that's going to suck. That's coming up fast because March 13th, today's March 13th and it's the last day of chemo. Woo! Okay, on a real serious note, I am a little afraid because what if the chemo wasn't enough? What if they didn't do enough chemo? And because they didn't do that, what if that comes back and it's like, oh, well, we should have done more chemo. Um, I don't think that's going to happen. But, you know, it's always there in the back of my mind thinking, oh, my God, did we get enough chemo in my system? Do we need to put some more in? Do it now. <laughs> but... Oh well, let's go get that last round of chemo. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> this is <laughs> birthday girl. Well, I thought it would be pink on the other side, so I could just write last day of chemo. But if I rotate it, I could put last day of chemo right there. <laughs> what? That's, I'll knock it. That's awesome. Until you try it. I, like I got it. you assortment. Oh, goodies today for our last day. We got Reese's mayonnaise, white, Kit Kat white, cookies and cream Hershey's, and uh, chili chip boy. I didn't know if I was in the mood for Oreos or not. I mean, you were in the mood for Oreos. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I love you. Mwah. Also, David made me this badass sash. It's so cool. He's the best husband ever. And now he's fixing my sign. He's adding to it. No pressure. And Cooper is enjoying the new rug that our awesome neighbors gave us. That was so nice of them. It's perfect, huh, Cooper? Oh, Cooper puppy. Show me a trick. Can you do a roll? All right. Chemo day. Also, Lucy's really excited for my last day of chemo too. Look at her, she's so excited. <laughs> Hi, Cooper puppy. So we just went and got our subway. And the Subway people were so nice. They gave me a free cookie as a congratulations for it being my last day at chemo. And then when I was walking in, this girl was all like, is it your birthday? And I'm like, no, it's my last day at chemo. And she's like, oh my God, that's even better. She's like, congratulations. And I'm like, thank you. So today is already starting off pretty good. I was a little worried because it is Friday the 13th. Dun, dun, dun. 
Hey yo! Look at that. Pull it together, Dad. I'm a terrible film person. <laughs> okay. Thanks for reminding me. That's fine. You know, my CRNA, whenever I had to have a C-section with my first son, so she told my husband before we went in, get your phone ready, get your phone ready, get your phone ready. And he just stood there and was just like flabbergasted. And she's like, where is your phone, Dad? Where is your phone? <laughs> That's get me. it. Yeah. I'm always in trouble for this. David just has chemo brain. That's okay. Yeah. It happens. <clears throat> yeah, because those two chairs weren't here last time we were here, right? So those so are fairly we're, new. We're rotating them around, kind of creating having enough our storage space inside that door and Close that little closet we have for storage. Gotcha. Um, those chairs around the way now are closed. Oh. Uh, so you know, semi-private rooms. Oh, really? Right that way. They're, yeah, they're going to combine those into a private room. So if someone comes in and has something sent, they're going to isolate them a little better. That's nice. That's really good. Don't have as many private or something. Here we go. Here we go. One, two, three. Come here. Hooray. Mm. It did. Oh, the pain. You want to just take it out and do it again? Because we can. <laughs> I, think, I think it's in the wrong spot. No, I'm good. I'm good. I think I'll pass. See, nobody ever wants to take it out and do it. Hey, maybe, maybe next time. Oh, okay. wait. Oh, wait. No, no wait. Last time. <laughs> I mean, if you, if you keep your port full, if you save your port for oh, a little while and give it flush. That's true. Oh, port flush. Um, port flush. You are good. Yeah, how long do you have to wait in between until they do the four flushes? Three. Oh, uh, yeah, that'll probably, yeah. I'll probably be back for that. Oh, so we'll be back for that. I'll be back for that. Yeah. Now, Abby, you know you won't always come back because you won't see us. Of course. You've got to see your match, but let me go over there and see the girls. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you better get my Starbucks. I always have to be the one. Yeah, pick up, pick up the goodies for your <laughs> <laughs> So they got me all plugged up. My little IV's going. We have 30 minutes till I get my chemo. David is getting out the crossword puzzles. I'm about to kick his butt. Tradition is a tradition. That's you losing. I was beating him. Let's go. Okay, David won. I'm going to deep. He won the crossword puzzle. To be, I had to beat two pages to beat you. This isn't called a crossword puzzle. What is this called? You go through this almost every time. Word search. Is it not a crossword puzzle? Yeah, word finds. Oh, it's a crossword puzzle. Where you have to like, they have the clues and then you have to guess and then you fill them in. I can't do that. <laughs> Almost done. Almost done. Yeah. Almost done with chemo. Should I be interviewing you? Yeah, I mean. How does it feel, Abby? It feels so great <laughs> to be, <laughs> to be <laughs> taking to be this out and be done. Right. We are really excited for you. Thank, Thank you. you. stuff on the floor over here. Mm -hmm. right. yeah, exactly. Trash can. Mm -hmm. Just securing the cleaning crew's yeah. job.
And I ain't gonna stand up. They only have to do that. No. That's pretty cool. <laughs> the party trick. Like it, it is. As long as it doesn't hit anybody in the eyeball. Oh, yeah. That's the whole thing. You just rip it off. Just like yeah. that. Just like that. Good. Hooray. Of course, you can take that off. There we go. How are you doing tonight? Yes. Hooray. Shower tonight. I like that. That would be nice. All right. All right. You know we have to make things. Okay. Thank you, everybody. Really appreciate it. Well, it's been rough. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about you, Dan, not me. <laughs> well, thank you, everyone. You've been great. You have done so good. So happy it's over with. Yeah. yeah. So I'm about to get into the shower. I don't have to wait 28 hours because I didn't get the new Nesta on body shot on my arm. So I'm off to the shower to rinse off all that chemo feel that I have going on. And I've been feeling pretty good, a little tired. I've been having really bad hot flashes, but I'm still just really excited because today was my last day of chemo. Yay! Day after chemo. And right now we're at Lowe's. David's going inside because I still can't go in anywhere for 48 hours. Um, so he's getting some varnish so we can finish up the front of our fence. So after that, we're gonna go home, paint the front of the fence. I'm feeling pretty good since my chemo yesterday. I'm just trying to enjoy today because like always, I know tomorrow and the day after tomorrow is gonna suck and I'll be living on the couch. So today I am gonna help David paint the fence. Day after chemo, out painting the fence. Like I said, we were gonna do and uh yeah that's about it for my last chemo i'm all done so no more chemo videos next video will be about getting my double mastectomy so stay tuned for that <laughs>